We start off tonight with the developing news we first told you about at 5. I'm Lydia Colbita. And I'm John Gray. Heavy police and fire department presence remains at the Port of Queemans right now. Let's go to News and ABC's Rachel Yankunis, who is there live at the scene. Rachel, what do we know? John, police have not confirmed any details on why there is such a heavy police and fire presence here. The activity is split between two different locations, the Port of Aquimans and this side street off of River Road. They're about three miles apart. Now, I've seen multiple police units go down this side street, but again, police have not confirmed what kind of activity is happening down there. Now, Quimans police are being assisted by multiple other agencies, including state police. There are several state troopers on scene. Also, Ravina Fire Rescue and Albany County paramedics arrived at the Port of Quimans shortly after we did. Now, we were not allowed near the scene because it's private property and police were not letting any media closer. Again, we are still working to confirm the details of what exactly is going on here. I have seen a lot of police presence down here off this side street. Of course, I will remain here on scene when any of the information becomes available. We do know that this side street leads to the Hudson River and there are train tracks back there. I have seen some CSX employees coming through here. Again, we will be here on scene and I will be sure to keep you uh, give you those updates on air and online. For now, live in Queenmans, I'm Rachel Young Kunis, News 10 ABC.